When you start your journey off as a photographer, you hear people talking about how great a 50 millimeter lens is in comparison to the 18 to 55 millimeter lens you get standard with most cameras. Here's a video and a comparison of the two. Let's go. Hey yo, what's up everybody? Keith from Key Photo Blog here, here with a comparison of the 18 to 55 millimeter lens versus the 50 mil prime lens. The kit lens has a variable focal length of 18 to 55 millimeters, and the 50 millimeter lens has a fixed focal length of 50 millimeters. The 18 to 55 millimeter kit lens has got a built-in image stabilizer, whilst the 50 mil does not. The 18 to 55 millimeter lens has a diameter of 58 millimeters and the prime lens has a diameter of 49 millimeters. The 50 millimeter prime lens has got more durability as it's got more metal casing on its back. The kit lens is 8.89 centimeters tall whilst the prime lens is 6.35 centimeters tall. The kit lens weighs 207 grams in comparison to the prime lens that weighs 169 grams. We will now mount these lenses on the same body with the same settings and see how they perform. From the close-up pictures, we can see both lenses produce the same amount of noise and take the same amount of time to focus on the subject. From the comparison, we can see that the 50 millimeter at f1.8 produces a much better Barker effect, along with brighter images than the kit lens, set to 50 millimeters at f5.6. The 50 millimeter prime lens gives a fixed and narrow field of view as compared to the 18 to 55 millimeter, which is a variable focal length. So from what we can see, um, the 18 to 55 millimeter lens is greater at wide angles in comparison to the 50 mil, which then leaves the 50 mil, which is great at portraits, close-up photography and night photography because of the lower f-stop. So don't forget to like and subscribe. Till next time, peace.